Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a um, a, a quick uh, Node Red video, and this is basically how you can export all of your flows from one Node Red instance to another. So this Node Node Red is running on the uh, the default Docker container for Node Red that you can get from them from Node Red themselves, and that doesn't have Python. And based on the version of Linux uh, running, uh, Python will be difficult to install. So what I did was um, I decided to uh, do a Ubuntu Docker and add Python to that. That was easier for me. So um, what I'm going to do is we'll start out. You click the hamburger menu. We click export. So this is a real this is a real easy process. Let me do that zoomed up a little bit. So we do hamburger and we do export. And you can see we have uh, a couple of options selected, current, and all. We're going to pick all. And right away you can see if you look down is that it uh, it gets every single tab. So these are the tabs I have open. They match, you know, up here, social, Twitter, my Twitter, social, Twitter, my Twitter. So we're going to download it. And you can see I already have one there. So we're just going to save it on top of that. Um, so that saves, oh, I saved it on flows. Oh, well, so I saved it on flows. So I have to remember that. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to just turn this Docker container off. Um, so what I'll bring up my uh, console here. And what we'll start out with, we'll just do, um, I'm not clear. So we'll do Docker stop and it's just node red is the name of that one. So that's the, um, the standard node, node red. And you can see uh, that it did in fact, that's the, all, all the message you get when it stops. It just responds, hey, this is me, I, I listen to you. So now if I go to the, uh, if I go back to the browser and I hit reload, we'll get a, a not found or whatever, it's like can't be reached. So, okay, so that one's down, let's start the other one. So to start the other one, what I'm gonna do is it's gonna be Docker and it's gonna be start and you gotta use AI and that gives you an interactive shell. Um, and what I'm gonna do, it's uh, called uh, node, node red Twitter. And that's because I'm using it for Twitter automation and it's got Python installed. And the same, so what you get there instead is just uh, you get the command prompt. So to start this, um, I think I just have to type node red and it'll start the server. Yeah, so not, now my server is starting. Now I don't have this background or anything because I just, I just kind of run it when I need to right now, but you could set it up as a service on this container or whatever. So now when I go back to, because they're on the same port, now you could set them up on different ports and just have them both running too, but um, you know, that doesn't seem like something I'm gonna wanna do. So now I've got my, um, my second one and you see I've got a few things on here already but let's try to import and see what happens um, I'm wondering if there's gonna be some name clash and I haven't done that yet so we'll see what so I'm gonna do import and select file and it's gonna be downloads let's see where did that file end up going let's close this and, and look at this uh, where this file ended up going. Desk oh <laughs> onto my desktop for some reason. So let's select the file, we go to desktop and not listed. There it is. Um oh I put it in a folder. Okay. So I tricked myself. Alright, so let's just import them all and see what happens. Alright, so um so these are types that I don't have uh, items for yet and I can see that it just created another tab for Twitter search so it doesn't seem to care about these names but that's good and that's it so now I have um, you know some stuff that I didn't want to recreate I wanted to like I wanted to reuse some of my database stuff that I already had done so now I don't have to recreate that in my new node and it's already it's basically already already saved I think actually I have to deploy um, that's okay so I'll add those and then I'll be good to go. I don't think Facebook profile works anyway. So anyway, I hope this helps you out um, and gets you past uh, some of the noob humps a little faster. And uh, have a great day.